And Hillary Clinton, Hillary Clinton, Randy, spent uh, a number of stops in Kentucky. She spent some time there. Clearly, she was campaigning uh, to, mm -hmm. to try to win in Kentucky tonight. Uh, if it holds and she does lose Kentucky and Oregon, and you face the prospect of these other states going forward as you head into Philadelphia, is it a nominee in waiting who is kind of hobbling to the finish line? Well, I'm going to, I remember 2008 when Hillary actually won the last six out of nine primaries at the end. And, you know, what happened is that um, President Obama was about 100 delegates ahead by the end. And people regrouped in front of or for President Obama, and you saw what happened. In fact, Hillary was one of the main champions for President Obama. Both Bernie Sanders and Hillary Clinton have run an incredibly spirited race. But at the end of the day, regardless of what the results are in Oregon or in Kentucky, particularly given how close Kentucky is, Hillary is 3 million votes ahead of Bernie Sanders. She's 2 million votes ahead of Donald Trump. So this has been a really spirited um, process, and it's very good that the American people get a sense of who all of these candidates are. But in the worst of days between Hillary and Bernie, there is no question that the, 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 the values that they carry are very, very different than what Donald Trump would bring to the presidency. He's a bully. Sure.